Today, the trucking industry is one of the largest industries in the world. There's over a million trucks on the road, ranging in size from four wheels to 18 wheels, small to large. The one thing all these trucks have in common is the Department of Transportation requires them all to have mud flaps. Without them, a driver can incur fees, lawsuits, and even points on their driver's license, resulting in higher insurance fees. Losing or tearing off a mud flap causes downtime for repair, which is costly for you, the truck driver, not to mention the adverse weather conditions you may face working to put the mud flap back on your truck. Where there's a problem, there's always a solution. A product's been developed that installs between your mud flap and the truck that allows the mud flap to release when it gets caught on something between the tire and a fixed object while backing up. The result? No damage to your mud flap or the bracket on the truck. Let's take a closer look at the device. The kit consists of two plates that bolt into the same holes that your mud flap is currently on, so no drilling is required. Remove the existing mud flap. Install the spring-loaded kit on the truck. Next, take the mud flap and bolt it to the lower plate in the kit. Once bolted to the mud flap, simply slide the bracket into the groove of the upper bracket. That's it, you're done. Installation is complete. Now, let's show the device in action so you can see the results. A driver realizes he's hit a fixed object while backing up and he hears the mud flap release. Realizing he's pulled the mud flap off the truck, he simply picks it up and slides it back into the groove of the spring-loaded bracket on the truck. In a very short time, he's back on the road. Simple, effective, and time-saving. This is a new state-of-the-art device with a patent and cannot be purchased anywhere else. Save time, money, and stick to what you do best, driving. For more information on this product and to place an order, visit the website at www.jmrmudflaprelease.com.